So right now we're on solo, which is an experience that everyone, everyone gets on a typical Outward Bound course. I always think solo is a gift that we can give our students. I loved the solo. <laughs> solo was a lot of fun, you know, go out on your own, build your own shelter, sleep. It was nothing like I've done before. It was just, it was cool. It was interesting. It was a great experience. You set up your own tarp and you sit and you get a minimal amount of food, a bunch of water and time to kind of sort things out. It's not easy in our world to find time when there isn't the noise of our culture. For a little bit of personal recharge, not only physical, but also mental and emotional. There's something about spending a night alone in the wilderness that seems really scary, uh, but actually it was surprisingly really nice and refreshing. Another purpose of Solo is to really just breathe in everything that's around us. Because sitting right here and the sun's out in these beautiful mountains, sometimes we're moving so much it's hard to sit and take it all in. In the downtime is when the reflection can happen. It's not only having an experience, but having the opportunity, the space to process that experience. I mean, it's the, probably the only time in your life where you sit and really in silence are looking at your surroundings. To be on solo and know that you can't talk to anyone whatsoever for 24 or 48 or 72 hours is, yeah, it's pretty unique. Everybody seems to take something away from it. It was a, a really great experience.